Tonight, Big Brother is back with another season of drama, fun, and betrayal. And while 12 new house guests will begin the battle for a half million dollars, they will not be alone because four of the greatest house guests of all time will join them to play a new game with new rules and a new prize. Welcome to Big Brother. It's a house like no other, where 53 cameras follow your every move and 98 microphones capture your every word. This is the Big Brother house. Tonight, a new group of house guests will enter this house with one goal in mind, to be the last one standing. They will live in total confinement, cut off from the outside world. Every week, the house guests compete for food, luxuries, and most importantly, power. Each week, they will vote to evict one of their own, until only one house guest remains to claim the half million dollar prize. And tonight, which four of these Big Brother legends will be back in the house? And how will they change the game? And in a second twist, one of the new house guests will leave before the night is through. It all starts tonight on Big Brother. Good evening, I'm Julie Chen. Welcome to Big Brother. We're about to embark on a summer unlike any other in the Big Brother house. Tonight, a new group of complete strangers will begin their battle for a half million dollars. But what they don't know is that a unique twist is about to confront them. Four of the most competitive, most popular house guests of all time are coming back. But these four legends aren't back to play the Big Brother game. They're moving back into the house to coach it. So, who are these returning Big Brother greats? You'll soon find out. But first, it's time to meet the new house guests. Just days ago, they were each surprised with their invitation to the biggest party of the summer. Are you kidding me? Is this for real? Woo! I'm going to Big Brother! Are you kidding me? I'm the biggest Big Brother fan ever. What I've been doing to get ready for Big Brother, getting in shape, I've been reading strategic books so that my mind will be set and right for the game. I want to go down as one of the greatest players ever. I'm a nurse. Breathe in real deep for me. I'm a southern girl. I'm extremely girly. I love to go shopping. I love makeup. But I can't stand to not be active. I could definitely kick ass in those cowboy boots. All right, thank you. You're welcome. I flip houses for a living. We have five properties right now. None of them have sold, and that's what's killing us. $500,000 is going to be very nice. Oh, my God. <laughs> yes. I'm going to Big Brother. That looks pretty good. Yes. Good job, honey. I am a newlywed. I went from being a single woman to marrying an amazing man who has five children. I'm extremely active. I spin bike, I lift weights, I run two marathons. I am ready. I'm gonna go in there and win that money. <sighs> I'm a chemical engineering student here at Tulane University. That is insoluble. My high IQ is gonna give me an edge on the competition. Being able to think on your feet is gonna help me sail no problem to the half million dollars. $500,000 ticket right there but no key. Why? Cheers. <laughs> I think my biggest strength in the house is going to be my social game. I know how to work my way around a cocktail party. On the outside, I look like your typical old southern gay, but underneath it, I'm tough, I'm talented, and I'm going to kick your booty. Oh my god, shut up! I'm like, oh! What's the invitation for? I want the key. I'm going to Big Brother! Woo! My theory is, if you're not having fun at what you do, then you should not be doing it. When you're from New York, you can handle anyone and anything. I'm definitely street smart, born and raised in New York, Sicilian blood, bring it. 
My brother is uh, Russell from Survivor. You have to know when to make big moves. So I can't play like you. <laughs> <laughs> I know one thing, I'll do anything it takes to win this game. Can't beat it on them. You can, you gotta gently put it on them. <laughs> I'm Kara and I'm a model. Look at that! Whoa. I'm 100% single. I've dated rock stars, bad boys, but I'm hoping to meet a nice guy and hopefully he's inside the Big Brother house. Go, Kara! Go, Kara! Woo! Yes! I'm going to Big Brother, baby! Yeah! This is it! I'm going to be Big Baby! I've been a professional chef for 15 years. Woo! The house guests are in for a surprise. I can even make slop taste like filet mignon inside this house. Woo! Baby, we're gonna be cooking! I was in a platinum selling band, all female metal band called Kitty. People may see me as being a heavily tattooed female, a minority being Puerto Rican, and of course I'm a proud gay woman. You either love me for it or you despise me for it. I'm a spray tan technician. People always think that I'm ditzy, but actually, I graduated from a Big Ten school. Okay, close your eyes and hold your breath. My strategy is to fill the house with love and great energy. Yummy! All right, listen, you got one hour to pack. Come on, come on, let's go, go. Oh my god, I gotta pack, I gotta pack. Definitely gotta have my leopard. I love leopard prints. If you don't like it, then oh well. Love me or hate me. You gotta have your Daisy Duke, so. Sorry, Dad. <laughs> Every boy needs at least one pair of Bo Dukes. The ladies love them. I like the guy, nerdy guys that wear the little geek glasses. <laughs> you can't be a genius without glasses. Let's just hope I don't have to spend my summer with the people who cause problems and drama and chaos. Oh, I'm gonna cause chaos the whole entire time I'm out there. I just might need a bigger suitcase. Hey, I love you all. Hope I do y'all proud. I love you, babe. All right, All right let me show you how to win, bro. <laughs> <laughs> hey, bring it back. Bring a win back. Hope that I come back with that money. You know. You will. You're you. strong. 500K coming to Vermont, baby! Woo! Oh, we saw him, baby. I'm going to Big Brother! Woo! Now that you've learned a bit about the house guests, let's bring them out. This is the first time that the house guests are all seeing each other. They are not allowed to speak to one another until they are inside the house. Welcome, house guests. Take a good look around you. The person in front of you could be your new best friend. And the person behind you just might stab you in the back. Inside the Big Brother house, anything can happen. The only thing that is certain is that once you walk through that door behind you, you won't come out until you've either been evicted or won the half million dollar grand prize. Is everyone ready? Yes! First four to enter the Big Brother house are Will, Ashley, Jody, and Frank. Please enter the house now. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Please, please, please. Please Go quick. Hey, I'm Will. I'm Frank. Frank, nice to meet you, Will. I think it's going to be the year of the hair. I think Frank and I are going to, we got this. We got, I got the long and sleek. He's got the, the updo perm. I'm going to do the big bed. I'm going to go ahead and call it right there. I'm going to go ahead and grab this full size bed before anybody else can. That way, there's a girl who needs a bed to share. She can jump in with me. Oh my god. I can't believe I'm really here. The next group to enter is Ian, Shane, Jen, and Danielle. You may now enter the house. Yeah! Here we go! Yes! Bedroom! Oh Honey, I'm home! As a huge, extreme Big Brother fan, I cannot believe that I'm in this house. What's up, pretty lady? Hi! Hi. Nice to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you. Jen, she's got the tattoos and the tongue piercing and she seems like all rocker chick. I've never seen anybody really like her in person. What is going on? 
And the final group to enter the Big Brother house is Willie, Joe, Kara, and Jojo. Please enter the house now. So I'm the last group to enter the house, and I'm like, I better get a bed. Is this a bed? Yeah. Wait. Yes. Okay. Someone put his bag on the bed. Go ahead. Honey. Thank you. <laughs> I always get my way. Like, come on, I'm not gonna get a bed. I'm from Pittsburgh. I live in, in LA now. So two LA girls. Yeah. Kara and Jojo are super cute. I want to turn Jojo into a My Little Pony, and then Kara into this Barbie doll, and I want to put them in my pocket. Wait, Ian, are you old enough to drink? Uh, I am 21, thank you wow. very much. Who needs glasses? Let's get the ball rolling, yeah. shall we? <laughs> well, my name's Will, with one L. I'm from Louisville, Kentucky, and I am a creative marketing consultant. I do like flash mobs and viral videos, stuff like that. Yeah. Will could be one of the prettiest chicks in the house. From behind, I might have walked up to him at a bar. I said, hey, baby, how you doing? Well, my name's Willie. I'm from Vint, Louisiana. Uh, I'm a tanker man. What we do is load and discharge barges. I'm trying to quit that, so I need to win. I'm a huge Survivor fan, and I think Willie might be related to Russell Hintz from Survivor. The resemblance is too strong. I'm 99.9% .9 sure of it. I'm Joe, I am a personal chef, so hopefully we will be eating like the bomb in here. Wow. <laughs> Teach me, please. <laughs> I'm Danielle, I'm 23, and I'm a kindergarten teacher. Aww. I decided not to tell people I was a nurse. I want them to think that I'm this naive, southern country girl that just plays with kids. I do not want them to know that I'm working on three degrees. They don't, they don't need to know that. Well, my name's Jody. I'm a newlywed. I just got married eight and a half months ago. First time. And I have five stepkids. So yes, I inherited, yes. That's it. I'm Ashley. I'm 26 years old. I'm a mobile spray tanner. You done? Yeah. Good. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm Ian. And I'm studying chemical engineering. So if the hot tub breaks, I'm the one to fix it. <laughs> Ian is kind of my type because he's wearing glasses and he looks a little nerdy. He's a cutie pie. Well, I'm Frank. Just moved to Naples, Florida about a year ago and I'm currently looking for work down there. Mmm, Frank's hiding something. I, I'm about 98% sure he's hiding some fact about what he does for a living. I'm Josephine, but everyone calls me Jojo. I'm from Staten Island, New York. And I'm a bartender, so we got the chef, the drinks. We're in trouble. <laughs> uh, I'm Jen. I was born in Staten Island. I live in Brooklyn, yeah. New York. Hey. Hey. What's up? What's up? I'm a musician DJ, and I am super excited to be here. Hell yeah! I'm Kara. I'm 29. I'm originally from Florida. I model, and I, now I live out here in LA. Kara might be the cutest girl ever in the history of the planet Earth. <laughs> My name is Shane. I am a carpenter. I renovate and remodel houses. I think Shane could be my type. When he said that he was a carpenter, you know, you unlikely assume that he's good with his hands. Well, I propose we all do a toast uh, to each other while we still while like we each other. While we all still like <laughs> each other, exactly. Yeah. All right, to all of us, success, big brother. Big brother Everybody's smiling, happy, and everything, but if I have my way, that won't last too long. These people don't have no idea what's fixing to come on them. The house guests seem comfortable now, but that'll change when we unleash our first twist of the summer, putting four Big Brother legends back in the house as coaches. And tonight, in another Big Brother first, the battle for survival begins as the summer's first competition sends one house guest packing before they even unpack their bags. Stay with us. Welcome back to Big Brother. 
12 house guests have begun their summer long battle to win a half million dollars. But what they don't know is that they'll each be coached by one of four Big Brother greats, some of the most memorable house guests to ever play the game. So, who is returning to the Big Brother house? It's time to find out. Now get out there and go kick their ass! I'm Dan Giesling, and I was the winner of Big Brother 10. Since winning Big Brother, I met the love of my life, Chelsea. So what do you think about me leaving for the summer? I'll miss ya. I'm still coaching football, and this past season, we actually won a state championship. As a football coach, the game and landscape is always changing, and in Big Brother, it's no different. I'm very, very excited that I get to combine two of my passions, coaching and Big Brother. Bye-bye, bitches! Hey, I'm Janelle Cruzina, and I was on Big Brother 6 and Big Brother All-Stars. Congratulations, Janelle! I hold the record for most competition wins in a season. Five powers of vetoes and four HOHs. Fuck some mixed with brains <laughs> is a deadly combination. <laughs> Since doing Big Brother, I've gotten married and I've had a baby. Oh, she just threw up on me. I'm the real housewife of Minnesota. I'm gonna be the kind of coach that pushes people to win, because that's what I do best, is win. I lost my dignity on a slippery wiener. I'm Brittany from Big Brother 12. Brittany, I have to ev evict you. I failed to see the big picture, and that was my big downfall in the game. I got played by an alliance of guys in my season. What was its name? Brigade. <laughs> I let something so obvious pass right in front of me. I need a lobotomy. Not kidding. Since I left the Big Brother house, I got married. It's gorgeous. I love that one. I know it's going to be hard in the Big Brother house, and I'm not going into it so naive as I was last time. Like, ooh, yay, roses and rainbows. Big Brother, super fun. I have everything to prove. I have to completely prove that I can even play the game. Chill Town is in the building. I'm Mike Boogie, I was on Big Brother 2, and I won Big Brother All-Stars. When I was on Big Brother 2, I met Dr. Will, and we formed the greatest alliance in reality television history, Chill Town. <laughs> Life is a lot different since All-Stars. I am now the proud papa of Brady. He loves the camera, just like daddy. Part of the problem with newbies is they're all amped up to play and win competitions, and they underestimate the value of a social game. I consider myself the best player to ever play this game. Mike Boogie, Brittany, Janelle, and Dan are back. And now it's time to let the house guests in on this summer's big twist. Hello, house guests. Yeah. Everyone looks comfortable. Yeah. As everyone knows, the motto of Big Brother oh, no. is... Expected. Expected. Yeah, expected. Expected. So, uh -oh. are you ready for this season's no. twist? This no. Bring it on, baby. When you received your invitation yeah. to the Big Brother house, you joined the ranks of some of the greatest house guests to ever play this game. Oh, no, please. And this summer, four of the best will be joining you. They haven't come here to compete against you. Instead, they will be coaching you. Here's how it works. Each coach will pick three house guests that they will guide all summer long. And they too have a lot at stake because if one of the house guests they've chosen wins it all, that coach will receive $100,000. When Julie tells us the coaches have money in the line too, you definitely realize this isn't one game going on. We have two games going on in the Big Brother house this summer. I think Dan, Hayden, Janelle. Boogie. Oh, here they come. Who's running? Who's running? Who's running? And I'm like, wow. 
here we go. Dan is a winner. He won Big Brother. Obviously, you guys don't need to be scared. I'm here to help Thank you, you and coach you up. So, it's a, hey, it's no joke. You, you're here to win, and I'm here to help you win. I want to get one of you the $500,000. Yeah, Who's yeah. it going to be? I hope you guys are ready to play. I'm going to coach my players to be the toughest, fiercest, and most competitive players out there. So at the end of the day, one of them is going to be holding the $500,000 check next to Julie. Big the house it was so it was so overwhelming they're coming at me I, I felt just like a piece of meat what's up Brittany how are you well I think Brittany has this great social game and she's very talkative I'm definitely a bit apprehensive about her becoming my coach because she was a bit of a diva and I don't see how that's gonna translate well into being a coach I, I watched your season I felt bad for you I felt bad for me too Daddy's home. see Boogie walk through the door and I am freaking out. It's like stepping into Yankee Stadium and playing baseball with Alex Rodriguez. I was 10 when I watched you the first time. <laughs> oh God! <laughs> okay. oh, yeah. <laughs> Janelle is my favorite Big Brother player ever, 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 ever. <laughs> I'm trying not to be like all these newbies and like freak out too. Hi, Hi Boogie. What kind of terms are you guys on? Who knows? <laughs> Janelle and I, we have a little history together as all stars. I was the one to evict her, and I definitely see a potential for us, uh, you know, butting heads a little bit. We're back! <laughs> so good to see you. You look great. Being back for my third time is absolutely bonkers, but. I'm the ultimate big brother player, and I'm gonna win this thing. The other coaches better watch out. Great. Just got real. Wow. Right? Yeah. Right? Just got real. Dude, has anyone ever told you this? Do you watch Survivor or no? Yeah. You know what I'm gonna say or no? Like Russell? Yeah. Yeah. I don't want people to know I'm Russell Hans's brother because they know Russell for being a, the, a jerk and a villain on Survivor. And if chaos starts happening in the house, they're definitely gonna be pointing a finger at me. And you're from the same area. Are you, are you related to him or no? No, I think he's from up north. Is he? Yeah. I think he's from Louisiana. I don't know. I ain't never seen him before. Yeah. I know who Russell Hans is. He's one of the most ruthless villains to ever play Survivor. He looks exactly like him. Like you put them next to each other, people would be like, yeah. yeah. I get that vibe that he like is almost certain that I'm Russell's brother. Is he gonna go around telling everybody else? Cause that could be a tool, obviously, to get me out of the house. He must be a good looking dude, son. <laughs> That's all I'm trying to stress. He got this kind of structure. <laughs> I assume he's his brother. He's a relative for sure. Oh, yeah. He's from Louisiana. Louisiana. Yeah, that, when I heard that. He just looks like him. Yeah, he looks he, just like him. He's Russell's. gonna try to play like him oh, and yeah. be super aggressive. To. Oh yeah. I'm not picking. Oh, <laughs> House guests, I need everyone to gather back in the living room, please. You may have wondered why you were given an invitation and not a key like in seasons past. That's because although there are 12 of you, there are only 11 keys to hand out. And tonight, you will have to earn yours. One of you will be leaving the house tonight. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> Not playing around this season. And coaches, that means one of you will be a man down. It's time for the coaches to pick their players oh my God. and for the house guests to battle it out in the first competition of the summer. Coaches, it's now time to pick the house guests that you think have what it takes to make it to the end. Remember, you will each pick three players. And if one of your house guests ends up winning Big Brother, you will receive $100,000. So choose wisely. The order of the pick was determined by a random draw. 
Brittany. Yes. Go ahead with the first pick. No pressure. I want my very first, most important pick to be the guy in the house that I think will be able to take it to the end. Someone athletic, sociable, able to pretty much get along with everybody. I pick Shane. <sighs> Ready? Let's do it. Yep. Nice. Mike Boogie, you're next. I'll take Frank. I picked Frank for many reasons. Obviously, uh, he's very athletic, but with hair like that and a personality to boot, I really feel like he can not only get along with the girls, but also the guys. Janelle, your turn. I'm gonna take Will with one L. <laughs> I'm totally working strategy into picking these players. I want competitive people, likable people, and people that look like they're good schemers. Dan, who do you choose? Hmm. The ideal type of person that I want that can win this thing is someone who's ruthless enough to stab people in the back, but nice enough to make that person like you while the knife's going in. Give me Kara. Okay, to be fair, we'll now reverse the order. That means Dan, you pick next. Give me Danielle. Janelle, you're next. I pick Ashley. I'm just getting passed up by every single person. And I'm like, eh, something's not right here. This is making me feel very, very uncomfortable. Mike Boogie. I'm gonna take my man Ian right here. All right. Thanks, man. Yeah, I'm a legend, man, no matter what. Go. Willie. Wow. We'll reverse the order once again. Brittany. Jojo? I thought it was gonna be last. I'll take Jen. Janelle. I'm standing here and I'm like, oh, I'll probably be picked. Well, I won't be last. I'm gonna go with Joe. And then I'm last! I'm like, what the hell? And that means, Jody, you're with Dan. The steal of the draft right there. Yay. We're happy to have her. Your fate now rests in the hands of your players. Yeah. Now, everyone knows that Big Brother is a summer-long slumber party. So, into your PJs. It's time for your first head of household competition of the summer. Coaches, you will not be competing. The head of household is the most powerful position inside the Big Brother house. Free from the threat of eviction, the HOH must nominate two house guests for eviction. Now, even though Big Brother is an individual game, tonight you'll be playing in teams. And the stakes have never been higher. The coach of the winning team will decide which one of his or her players gets to be the first head of household. But the coach of the last place team has the dreaded task of sending one of his or her players home tonight. And here's how it works. On my go, one member of your team will make his or her way across the mattresses to the large bin on the opposite side. Bring back one bear if you fall at any point, you must return to the end that you last left. The first team to get all three bears onto their bedroom shelf and then turn off their nightlight at the bear bin will win this competition. At the 20 minute mark, each coach may make one substitution. Obviously, the, the first head of household, you know, you're competing for that, and that's great. But you're also competing not to finish last and have to send one of your players home. I'm completely sick right now. I am shaking in my frickin' boots. If there is a god, please don't let me go home tonight. <laughs> I think they know my brother is Russell Hance, and if I don't win this competition, there's a possibility I could be going home tonight. On your mark. Oh. Get set. Oh my god. Go. Now you jump on the mattress and it starts shifting back and forth. 
you jump to the second one and it's turning 360 degrees. And then the last one, it's like a teeter-totter. Yeah. That last one sucks. Yeah, Ian! Yeah, Ian! Go, baby! Hold on! Go, go. Come on, come on, come on, come on! You want me to go? Yeah, go, 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 go. <laughs> good, good. Now you gotta go deep on that. Go as far as you can on that. When I got on the spinny thing, I, I had the worst motion sickness ever. I just couldn't make it across. Right? Yeah. Careful. Yeah. Take your time. Take your go back, time. go back, go back. You got it. Come on, baby, take your time. Because I fell off the second mattress, I had to go back to the teddy bear pit and start over. There you go. Come on, baby, jump! Woo! Go, go, go! Way to go. Shane scores the first bear for Team Brittany. Belly flop, belly flop, away. Yeah! Woo! We did it. Okay, it's ready. Wait, Team wait, wait. Janelle has wait, their wait, first okay. bear. Take your time! Oh, you got it. We don't have a bear yet down here. Yes, yes. Come easy, baby, yeah! I got it, all right. Team Boogie has their first bear. Come on, Danielle. You got it, come on. Oh, man, that thing hurts. It's done. Yeah. We're in last place. We're yeah. fine. I see we're in last place, but I'm thinking I have long arms, I have long legs. I'll be able to do this. I'll just be able to reach across. Jody's out there busting her ass. She's trying her heart out and she's giving it her all. Oh, oh my face. It's like World War III up in this house. People are flying and flopping like flapjacks. Go Ashley! I'm so dizzy. I kind of did the Frogger technique. This is like a real life version of Frogger. Go, Willie! Woo! You got it! You got it! Yes! Okay, ready, go. Got it. Go ahead, go, go. Whoa, whoa, stay low. So we got two bears up, one to go, cakewalk. That a girl, that a girl. Go, Daniel. Kara scores the first bear for Team Dan. It's okay, Ian. Get the bear comfortable on you. Smart man, smart man. Yes. Yes! yes. Hang, 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 hang. All right. Come on, yeah. Ian scores the second bear for Team Boogie. Stay on the edge, it'll lift back up. Stay on the edge. Yeah. Uh, grab it with your Take hand. Your time. Jojo was exhausted. She would jump on it and it would tilt up. She had just like slid off of the mattress yet again. I mean, this happened like a hundred times. Oh, oh my God, oh my God, okay, okay. Hang on, hang on, hang on, stay by yourself. Yes! Yes! Woo! Yes! Oh, woo! Got it. All right, girl. Okay. Go, go. Make this Got one it. in, Jojo. We could win this. I know. We it's can you, win babe. this. Come on, come on Ashley. Come on. We know you can do this. You can do it, Ashley. Teddy bear. Thank you, guys. Grab it! We have a three-way tie so far. Come on. We yeah. believe in you, Jen. Get ready for it, baby. So it's me, Jen, and Ashley, and we all have one bear left to get across in order to win. I want it so bad, this is mine. Okay, I got it, I got it. We were going neck to neck. I'm climbing for my life. There's no if, ands, or buts about it. I'm not letting myself down. I'm not letting Brooklyn down. I'm not letting anybody down. Can't get enough Big Brother? You know you can't stop watching. See what's happening inside the Big Brother house whenever you want with the live feed on CBS.com. All day, every day.
There you That's go, Jojo! Come, Come on, go, Jojo! Keep Come on, Jojo! Keep balance! Balance! There it is, Jojo. I can do this, I can do this, I can do this. There's a flight to JFK tonight! You're gonna be on it? Let's go! Come on, Ashley. Oh. You got it, you got it! Oh. Yeah, we got a fight still, baby! I know. We got a fight still, okay. come on! Get on your feet! Yeah, John, be careful, be careful! There you go, don't let it fall! Be careful, be careful, jump! Oh, you're learning how to do it. Let's go, Danielle. I'm thinking, like, I have to do this. There's no questions. I don't want to be sent home on the first night. We get one more bear, we're right back in this. So I don't want my team to panic. Same thing on the way back. All day. No. You're not. Come go. Ah! Yes! Get on your feet. Get on your feet. Next. Go. Stay on, stay on, stay on. Stay on. Stay on. Stay on. Just jump. Just jump. Run and jump. Yes. Go. 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 You got it. Go. Go. You did it. Oh you did it. Oh yes. yes. It feels so great to have one of my players win HOH, and it was the best thing that could have happened to me the first day in this house. I'm just ecstatic. Congratulations, Brittany. Your team has won. But remember, this is also a race to not come in last. So keep going until the very end. No, no. Come on, Ashley. Sorry, Danielle. We can't wait this long. 20 minutes has passed, coaches. You may now make a substitution if you wish. And after 20 minutes, you could sub out one of your players and put in another player to finish the contest for you. I immediately subbed in Frank for Jen. We ain't going home! We ain't going home! And Frank scores the third bear for Boogie. Okay. We're here! We're here! Oh God. Throw us the We're teddy here. bear! We're here, baby! Put it on the <laughs> Come on, baby! Janelle oh, has their back, third back, bear. <laughs> comes in second. Boogie is third. Sorry, right, almost, Kara. You almost hey. got it. Good job. Hey. Come here, sir. Hey, good job. Proud of you guys, all right? Brittany, you must now choose one of your players to be the first head of household of the summer. Please make your decision now. I choose Willie. Booyah! Woo! <laughs> I don't know what it feels like to win a national championship or a Super Bowl, but it can't feel much better than this. The target is on my back. It's not no more. Congratulations, Willie. You are the first HOH of the summer. It was very easy for me to choose Willie as the HOH because I think that he needs this week as HOH to be able to make some deals and solidify himself a place in the house. Dan, as coach of the last place team, you have the most difficult decision of all. You will have to send one of your players out of the house and out of the game for good. I'll give you a little time to make up your mind. My team finished last, so at this point, I'm gonna have to cut one of my players loose, and which as a coach, I don't take very lightly. Dude. Here I am, the executioner. I gotta end someone's dream right now. Right, let's go talk. Come talk. At this point, Kara's safe. I know she has a cool head. She competed very well in the competition. Now I have to decide between Jody and Danielle. The decision I have as a coach goes well beyond what just happened in this competition. And not everything from here on out is gonna be physical. So I gotta look at who's gonna play this game the best. So you're me. Yes. You gotta make a call. The dark haired girl, Danielle, I mm -hmm. felt like she got defeated really quickly. Okay. We don't have time to be defeated. Yeah. We no, just gotta keep moving to the next thing, be positive, you know? So that's what I would do. I deserve to be here. I worked my butt off, I smacked myself in the face, I got a fat lip, both of my lips hurt, my teeth hurt. I did the best that I could do, and that's all you can really ask for anybody. 
who would you want to get rid of? I, I feel like Jay is super sweet. Um, I feel like she might cause drama though. Okay. I feel terrible. I can't help but feel like it's my fault. I'm worried. My fate's in Dan's hands. Hello, everyone. Please gather in the living room. Now, Dan, as a losing coach, you must send Kara, Danielle, or Jody home. Please stand, face your players, and make your decision. You guys all busted your ass as a coach. That's all you can ask for is that I know every one of you did your best. Um, but unfortunately, Uh, Jody, I'm sorry, I have to evict you. Well, thanks, guys. Ugh, it was fun. Thank you, sorry, Dan. Jody. It was a pleasure to meet you. Pleasure I appreciate to meet you. it. You guys, kick some butt. You did so fun. Have fun. I felt really bad for Jody. She was super sweet, but somebody had to go home, and I'm glad it wasn't me. Sorry, I'm glad you didn't have to All right. I've been watching this show for a dang long time, and I have never, ever seen anything close to as cruel. If that's only the first night, we've got a whole summer of things in store for us. <laughs> All right, have fun. This game is mine now. I'm not really worried about Britney's game or these other players' game. It's, it's all about me. The game has officially begun, but tonight was just the start. Get ready for a summer where everyone should expect the unexpected. The excitement is just getting started in the Big Brother house. As the house guests play their own individual game, will tensions erupt between them and their coaches? Tune in Sunday at 8, 7 central, when a new competition unleashes a brand new power on the house. Then, on Wednesday night at 8, 7 central, find out if the power of veto can save the nominees. Oh, yes! And Thursday at 9, 8 central, don't miss the season's first live eviction. We just got to get the right person out this week. To see my exclusive interview with Jody, go to CBS.com. And while you're there, you can continue to follow the house guests every move by subscribing to the live 24-hour internet feed. You can also get an uncensored look at life in the house on Big Brother After Dark, airing live each night on Showtime 2. Well, another season of Big Brother has officially begun. As always, let's eavesdrop on the house guests. From outside the Big Brother house, I'm Julie Chen. Good night. Okay, I'm ready to get out of these shorts. 100%. percent That is real. <laughs> Yeah, already down to 11. She's a really good sport. Wish I could have done Oh my gosh. Ding, 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 